because this doesn't stretch very far. I'll use my teacher voice. There you go. <laughs> I don't know. Um, good evening. My name is Matthew Katz. For those who don't know me, I'm a four-term president of the Resident Association between 2000 and 2012. And um, in the interest of complete disclosure, I am married to Sherry Helstein, who's home sick tonight and couldn't be here, who is an elected uh, member of the Board of Directors of the Los Ivan Senior Association. She is the elected secretary and has been working with President Walker Parker since June, seven days a week, to uh, restore the, uh, the good graces of RISA in uh, the community and in the RIOC, uh, after some questions were raised with the previous administration. Uh, I hope to ask this question directly of Mike Shimazaki, who is in fact the only candidate who is a seated member of the board at present. Uh, but I still would like to read this into the record because I think the community has a right to know some of the backstory. At the last REOC board meeting, Margie Smith received support from her fellow resident directors for a, quote, conditional acceptance of public purpose fund fund funding for RISA if Sean uh, Singh of REOC, their financial person, approves the paperwork requested. That approval is pending and is expected momentarily. And I can tell you that this board has been working nonstop to get that paperwork together. Michael Shinazaki refused to join his fellow resident REOC board members and refused to say why he wouldn't support reasons receiving these funds, which are essential, essential to continuing to offer programs to the community. It should be noted that REOC accepted the application from the new RISA administration, elected last June, that the RIRA Public Purpose Fund no, Committee no, voted this to is allow not a question. It is a question. It Aaron, is not. Aaron, Matt's been going on for five minutes. And when I am done, Aaron, I would stop. It, it's, okay. almost, it's almost done, Aaron. Yeah. Okay. I can see how yeah. much more. This is not up to you, Aaron. So okay. Well, okay. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. Just hold your order. Mm -hmm. um, REOC accepted the application from the new RISA administration elected last June that the Rural Public Purpose Fund Committee voted to allocate funding as requested and the full Rural Common Council endorsed that recommendation. My question, Aaron, is why is Michael holding back from accepting REOC's determination? This community has a right to know. Thank you. Unfortunately, we don't have Michael here to say what it's to answer that question. Uh, but we do have Mark Locke. And we're going to give Mark an opportunity 